Benign prostatic hyperplasia, or BPH, can happen when a small gland called the prostate causes bladder problems in men. BPH is very common in older men. By age 60 the majority of men have at least some symptoms of BPH. Causes The prostate is a small gland that's part of the male reproductive system. It sits just below the bladder, which stores urine, and in front of the rectum. During ejaculation, the prostate squeezes fluid into your urethra, the tube that sends urine from the bladder out of the body. The fluid protects the sperm and is part of the liquid that makes up semen. In young men, the prostate gland is about the size of a walnut, but it continues to grow throughout your adult life. As the prostate gland grows, it starts to press on the urethra like a clamp. It also presses on the bladder and irritates it. Over time, the wall of the bladder weakens, and the bladder is unable to empty completely. Symptoms Benign prostatic hyperplasia can cause symptoms such as urine stream stops and starts, a sudden urge to urinate, urine leakage or dribbling, a sudden inability to urinate at all, or more frequent urination, especially at night. Most of the time, these symptoms are caused by BPH, but more serious conditions such as prostate cancer can also cause them. So it's important to see your healthcare provider if BPH becomes more severe because it can cause problems such as urinary tract infections, kidney damage, bladder stones, and inability to control urination. If you have symptoms of BPH, your healthcare provider will ask about your medical history and give you a physical exam, which will include a digital rectal exam. Your healthcare provider will insert a gloved finger into your rectum. This allows him or her to feel the size of the nearby portion of your prostate. Your healthcare provider may recommend certain tests, such as a urine flow study, may be recommended to determine how quickly your urine flows. If you need a prostate-specific antigen or PSA blood test, this test can help rule out prostate cancer. You may also have a cystoscopy. During this test, a thin flexible tube is put into the urethra through the tip of your penis. This test let your healthcare provider to see inside your urethra and bladder. You might not need any treatment, if your symptoms are mild, your healthcare provider may keep an eye on your symptoms. Instead you may be instructed to make some lifestyle changes, like not drinking fluids at bedtime and reducing your caffeine and alcohol intake. You may be taught, double voiding, which is when you urinate more than once each time you go to the bathroom, to completely empty your bladder. If you need treatment because your symptoms are giving you a lot of trouble, the most common kind of treatment is medicine. Some medicines can help slow prostate growth, other medicines can help relax your bladder and prostate, letting urine flow more easily. Surgery to remove part of the prostate, is another option for many men. This often relieves the incomplete bladder emptying caused by BPH. The most common type of surgery doesn't need an external cut, instead, your healthcare provider removes part of the prostate through your urethra. There are several types of surgical techniques. The type of surgery will depend on your situation. Talk with your healthcare provider about which procedure is best for you. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and support us to learn more. Thank you.